The Kansas State Capitol, known also as the Kansas State House, is the building housing the executive and legislative branches of government for the U.S. state of Kansas. Located in the city of Topeka, which has served as the capital of Kansas since the territory became a state in 1861, the building is the second to serve as the Kansas capital. During the territorial period, 1854 to 1861, an earlier capital building was begun but not completed in Lecompton, Kansas, and smaller structures in Lecompton and Topeka were where the territorial legislatures met. The dome, at 304 feet, 93 meter, is taller than the 288 feet, 88 meter, United States Capitol Dome, although its diameter, 50 feet, 15 meter, is approximately half that of the National Capitol, 96 feet, 29 meter. It is one of the few capitals in the United States that continues to offer tours that go to the top of the dome. Visitors enter the dome by climbing 296 steps leading from the fifth floor to the top. The land for Capitol Square was donated by Cyrus K. Holiday in 1862. Construction on the East Wing began in 1866, using native limestone from Geary County, Kansas. Construction began on the West Wing in 1879 using limestone from Cottonwood Falls, Kansas and in 1881, the legislature authorized and appropriated funds for the construction of a central building to link the two wings. Construction of this central building began in 1886, and the contract for dome construction was let in May, 1889. The building was declared officially complete in 1903, after 37 years of construction. It was not until 1988 that a design for a sculpture to stand atop the dome was finally approved. Ad Astra, a 22 feet, 6.756 meter, bronze sculpture weighing 4,420 pounds, 2,000 kilograms, was installed atop the dome on October 10, 2002. The building was featured prominently on Kansas license plates issued from January 2001 until April 2007. In December 2001, the State House began a $120 million modernization project. The project included restoration of its first through fifth floors, the rehabilitation and expansion of its basement, restoration of its exterior masonry and copper roof dome. By the time the project finished in spring 2014, scope creep and delays resulted in a total cost of $332 million.